I'm going to stalk Brett next. <laughs> Connor first, me second. Brett sucks. I mean, Brett next. Welcome back to the Greener Lawn. Today, we are going to break his cherry on <laughs> putting down some next products. He's going to be throwing down the super power hit. He's going to be throwing down D-Thatch, Aerate, and RGS. Stay tuned. Let's go. This is Josh. <laughs> I like it. You want more? <laughs> I like Pop it. Pop a shave? What do you want? There we go. Pop a shave. Pop I a like shave. It. We'll try that one more time. Okay. We have Pop a shave today, and he is going to be using the next products. He's going to be throwing them down. He has never used it in this beautiful lawn over here. Over here, we are going to be putting in the products that we explained. It's the super power hit. Starting off with our water. Go ahead and fill it up with one gallon. He needs a new hose. Hose link. Yes, sir. This man up. Good enough. Sweet. Seven ounces Seven of ounces. the RGS. You're not getting dirty, you're not feeling it, right? Close enough. Close yeah. enough. You can never go like wrong it. with more, right? RGS is the only one that you're gonna really wanna pay attention to, but as long as we're within the ballpark of the three ounces per thousand, right now during the heat above 85 degrees, you're not gonna hurt a thing. This 24. one, we're gonna do 25 ounces. And delivery service for you. Here you go. Thanks, sir. Nice aerate for you. Same 25? Yes, please. Every drop counts. How'd you do it with no mess? I need the secret. I don't know. I'll come do them for you. You should see my garage. I'll show you that right here. Okay. Get control of your hose. Super easy. And you're gonna see it, it has about a, a three foot um, to five foot wide swath. And so we'll just have you just go ahead and walk it and touch this edge, overlap it by about three, four inches on each of the edges. Okay. And so you're just gonna walk it one Let's way. Keep it off the concrete. So it doesn't matter. matter. This but not three to four inches on the concrete. Yeah. So you ready for this? Let's do it. Let's go. Ah, yeah, we have the juice now. Go ahead and walk. Walk normal speed. You can hold it a little bit higher and get your swath a little bit wider. There you go. Perfect. Oh no, he got it on the sidewalk. <laughs> Guess I'm not perfectly spill proof. This but not three to four inches on the concrete. Yeah. Yeah, I won't have you spray for me. I'll just have you pour it in the buckets for me. There you go. Dill, let's All right. go. So tell me why anybody would have that kind of a sign in their yard. Let's be real. Come on now. That's a pass. Get the hang of it now. Spraying it down. All the goodness on the sidewalk. Oh my goodness. So can you walk, talk, and spray it all at the same time? Sure, maybe. All right. So, so far you've done half your yard. How are you feeling about this? I'm excited. Pretty stoked. How's the application going down? Pretty easy. Heavy in spots. But for your rookie. first time. Yeah, rookie. <laughs> you can always tell where he's going if you look at the difference in the color. Up to that point right there is the passes he's been making. You can really see it if you come this way. See how it goes down a little bit darker? 
Oh yeah, that's the goodness. But you can definitely see where he's been kissing the edges a little heavy, but he's gotten better. We explained it to him here and he's doing extremely well over here. Let's One way. Off the concrete. But not one. three to four inches on the concrete. Yeah. You know where you've been, just look at the concrete. Yes. Well, where you've been. <laughs> he's figured it out now. <laughs> I want to make sure we see Ooh, the pretty. Have you ever used any liquid fertilizers or biostimulants before? Um, maybe on accident. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how would you have an accidental fertilizing or biostimulanting? Well, if I bought something in a bottle. You can talk about it, go ahead. Then, uh, accidentally picking that up and putting it in my car. That would be why it was an accident. Don't tell the wife, though. Oh, um, <laughs> that part might be edited out. There you go. I'm purposely left in, though. <laughs> no, not that I can remember. I mean, not, not recently. Not recently? No, it's all been granular. Nice. Don't waste it on the neighbors. You gotta keep that domination line tight. You got some weak stream issues over here. What's going on? <laughs> Drink of choice, water. 98% water. <laughs> Plus all the Mountain Dew. Mm -hmm. Goodness, so after that application, what do you think about it? It was good. It was easy. Not too hard. It, was... it definitely is something that uh, even on your first time, it goes down extremely easily, yeah. right? Got the hang out pretty quick. So what was probably the most tricky part of the whole thing for you? Um, I guess probably figuring out the, the amount to lay down. So that's normally off the some math. Yeah, it's just off the math. It'll tell you um, how many ounces per thousand on the containers. RGS right now is three ounces per thousand. D thatch is nine ounces, and uh, aerate is going to be the same nine ounces. But you can range all the way up to those, depending on how often, like what kind of feeding technique you want to do. Because you can do micro applications and spoon feed your lawn and do lower amounts and do it more frequently, or you can just do the heavy hit of what it is like we did today, the three ounces, nine ounces, and nine ounces, and just go ahead and let it have the power hit. So that makes it a little bit easier. Yeah. It, it works out really nicely. It's not a hard thing, but you know, it's, it's all on the side of the label. If I would have just grabbed it out of my truck and said, we're making a video right now and giving you some time to actually read it, you'd have mm -hmm. figured it out. Because right. you haven't even looked at the bottles yet. Right. So. With the sprayer, you've never used an electric sprayer like that. What'd you think no, of that? That was good. I have a one gallon pump sprayer. So if you had to do this tomorrow by yourself, would you feel confident doing it by yourself? Absolutely. Yeah. Simple. So is there anything that you'd like to tell anybody on what your first time user fillings are? Joy. Joy. <laughs> I like it. This man is joyful over his use of the products today. And if you were to tell anybody what's the most difficult part of it, what would you say it is? Uh, using the hose with a leak. It's about as tough as it gets. You never want a leaky hose. Never want a leaky hose. Yeah, yeah you definitely don't want the drip. Definitely can't have the drip. All right, so I'm gonna ask him really quick if he has any questions. If he doesn't have any questions, I do have a question for you. Have you tried these products? If you haven't tried these products, after seeing him using them for the first time and seeing how easy they actually were to use, are you interested in using these products? With that said, Josh, do you have any questions? No questions. Sweet, I go. like it. See, they're so simple that he doesn't even have questions at the end of all of this. But we do want to feature something that he did pick up just on the outro of this. I'm Jeremy of The Greener Lawn. Make her dream. Ha <laughs> ha. So what are your plans for Betsy? Uh, make her look pretty with the stripes, win the next stripe contest. Who do we 
have here? That's it. And that's it just got called up from? Florida State University. Wow. Bringing her to the show. Nice. nice. What were they using it down there for? Um, that's a good guess. <laughs> we, we, we're guessing their agriculture department was working on plots of grass testing. But nice. Everybody's going low on me. I don't know yeah. why. Your lawn was looking good higher. Why would you uh, assault it with this thing? Why not? <laughs> why not? Yeah, ask Brad. Ask. Don't <laughs> ask Brad. <laughs> God, what? No. No. N no. It's never any good if uh, it doesn't start with one pull. Ruh roll. Yep, let's see what you got. All right, make sure the fuel's not off. Okay, that's a good thing. Make sure it's on. Cross your fingers. Hope to die. Mm -hmm. Stick Ready? a dirty needle in your eye. It's like 10 o'clock at night. We're really not going to run it across it. But once again, this is Papa Shafe. Papa Shafe. And we have been playing out in his lawn. We've seen his new toys. We've played with the gambit of toys. We're definitely going to let you go. I'm Jeremy of the Greener Lawn. Maker Green. Which camera do I block?